If you are working from the home with a laptop and you want to improve your economics, this video is for you. Because I'm um, so big YouTuber, most of the companies won't even reply to my emails, but there is one Neomons. And they really answer my emails. They sent me different kind of laptop stands, so you could have an idea what kind of options is present and how to use them. This video has been made with a commercial partnership with Neomons. In upper corner of the video, you can see always the code name of the current stand, and all the links will be down below. During this video, I just put laptop stands up, and you can see how do you need to drive them. When I started to unpack the package, they sent it to me. I had this similar feeling what I had when I was young with the transformers. From the looks, always you don't know where you end up, and that is only a good comment. I had my battles with the different stands, and then I started to figure out there is a quite plenty of handy options to have. If you want to have solid structure, you can leave it on the desk, and if you want the light and portable on the go setup, there is also option for that. What kind of benefits can you have from the laptop stand? High temperatures are the enemy of electrical components. How do they go, the shorter the life period they might have, and good cooling is always in place. If you have an external keyboard and mouse, then you can easily elevate the laptop higher grounds and maintain good neck posture while watching the screen. Most of the stands work also with the tablet, so think about getting good Bluetooth mouse and keyboard. If you need to use tablet a lot on the go, then those stuff are priceless in the long run. If you are a laptop owner of the Apple products, then you might like this laptop bracket. You can easily install 11 to 17 inch laptop to vertical position and aesthetics. It's darn nice looking combination. You can also use Windows laptop in vertical position, but there is a multiple screen settings what you need to adjust to the right. And if you need tips for that, hit the comments down below. And lastly, the laptop or monitor risers. Example, my current screen leg structure won't let me lift up the screen, and with that height, I feel that it's way too low, and when I check the bottom of the screen, my chin tilts down. In this kind of cases, you can use the riser to get your laptop higher or elevate the whole screen. But if it's your main setup, I strongly suggest to get good monitor arm. Once you put your money to it, it will going to last a long time and the quality of those products exceeds in many ways. Adjustability is at another level and I can strongly say I will be always using good monitor arm. If you wanna find out how to tackle working with the laptop and external screen, save some space at the top of the desk and get your cleaning done easily, at the end of the video there is a suggested video to another video. I hope to see you there next. For you all remote workers, dare to be different.